friends one day me and my friend we were having an argument on topic of decision making he strongly believes that all decisions are taken based on facts and data so we call it as data driven decision on contrary there is also a type of uh, decision which is based on your strong instinct if you dig deeper uh, these instincts are much more stronger the reason behind is there is a strong analysis which is being done by your brain based on the facts uh, your experiences with life and also keeping in mind your capability in terms of uh, strengths and weaknesses so this is quite stronger there is a high risk which is involved and that's one of the reason that people are scared of taking this decision most of them they call it listen to your heart or a gut feel but you have seen uh, people who follow this have created miracles in their life and uh, they have yield some greater results as well but when it comes to businesses and corporates uh, we can't uh, show this internal analysis in front of them and that's where pure data driven decisions supersedes and that's where my friend wins now why are we talking about uh, this data and analysis in today's video the reason is we all know that ai technology is based on data so data is at the core of it and uh, we all are fortunate enough to have abundance of data of all types of domain and whatever we need available for us and that too free but where is this data so let's get started and find out when we work on ai uh, models what are the types of data that we generally need first thing is we need numerical data related to different domains now for example if you need bank related data then we already have uh, world bank open data set which is available you can look at it another area is healthcare then world health organizations open data is also available to use now uh, and if you need government related data then you have data.gov for uh, all us government agency related data you have similarly data.gov.uk gives the uk uh, uh, government data and if it's data.eu then all european union government data is available if census related demographics related data if you need then data.census.gov is another data set which is available apart from numerical if you are looking for image data then google image data is one good repository that you can look at uh, and another one is uh, what you have is image net now image net has all labeled image data readily available for you to use it moving to audio then in case of audio then you have uh, mozilla common voice that's one uh, which you could use another one is audio set by google which has 10 second data sets uh, related to instrument uh, sounds or vocals and other thing and then there is a repository of songs called as million song data all audio things taken care of let's move to another set of data that we need is if you need sensor data lidar data location data then another one which is uh, quite openly available is way more um, open uh, data set uh, that is available which is ca capturing using their self driving car uh, and last but not the least is text data which is quite uh, useful these days um uh, and uh, wiki data is one big repository that you already have another one is uh, common crawl which is today talk of the town the reason for that is your gpt technology wherever there are large language models being built this is the base for it apart from this if you are looking for search engine for data and some more huge repository where everything you get at one place then let's look at that if 
you are someone who is working day in day out on different types of AI models and are looking for a one stop solution for all the data sources then uh, look at these data set search engines and huge repositories like uh, Google's data set uh, search another one is AWS open data search uh, this is maintained by Amazon uh, and uh, Microsoft also maintains similar kind of data in the name of uh, Microsoft Research uh, Open Data. Apart from that, you also have UCI Machine Learning Repository. Now, this is maintained by University of California, Irvine and cut across multiple subjects. So, this is also a good repository to look for. Another one which I have tried and tested is Kaggle data set. This uh, ranges right from university rankings, search trends, movie reviews, crime uh, data, retail and so on and so forth. When we are talking about uh, retail, don't forget to check out Amazon reviews data. Uh, that would be quite helpful if you are in retail uh, segment. Depending on what you're working on, uh, you can actually pick uh, the right uh, source of data and start using it. Hope today's video was informative uh, to you and will come handy when you work on your AI model. So all the best to you and with that, me Falkao Sen signing off for today. Mm -hmm.